it's Wednesday and it's time to put the whip on it. I'm going to turn this box cake into a homemade cake. Hey, this is Audrey with Cooking Couture Atlanta, honey. Baby, we about to put the whip on it. Boom! I'm about to, listen, I'm about to tell you what to do to the Duncan Hines perfectly moist box cake to make it taste just like homemade. I'm talking about woo, boom. Here you go. We about to Alright, so check this out. All, all the directions on the back. I'm just all busting it open. On the back, it says three eggs. Add you an extra egg. I put four eggs in it. Everybody will tell you that's um first thing I always say is an extra egg. When we was doing brownies, if the recipe call and that's that's the secret part I leave out. <laughs> I always put an extra egg. Okay. So then where it says a cup of water, I'm not doing a cup of water. I'm doing a cup of buttermilk. Mm -hmm. I have a camera person. Hold on, let me, I would have had the buttermilk. I had to do it like I'm doing it by myself. Like I was doing your little close-ups and shit. <laughs> Whole buttermilk with all the fat. Then I got somebody here that can taste it and tell us what's up. Alright. So listen, let me get a whisk. Yeah, I'm about to show out now because I got somebody holding the camera. Alright. Secret recipe. Boo y'all. Jello pudding. So since I'm doing French vanilla, you want to put some vanilla pudding. Now everybody that know me. No for real. Even I put uh sometimes I put pudding or gelatin in my um cakes from scratch it just depends um here we go oh shit all right so then i like to whip it in you put your pudding in with your cake mix and then you whip it in i like to mix my um wet all together so I'm gonna put the buttermilk I'm putting the extra egg so I got four eggs I already mixed that together I'm adding a cup of buttermilk and instead of oil doing butter mm. it, it calls for a fourth of um a fourth of cup of oil and this is a little it, it calls for a third cup of oil and I, this is a little over a third cup of um butter pure butter uh what it is is three tablespoons that's what it was it wasn't quite a a half a stick with the third stick of butter. And I let the butter melt, but the butter wasn't hot when I added it. The buttermilk was room temperature and the eggs were room temperature. That really matters. I wanna add some vanilla and some almond. Let me see that. I wanna add vanilla. Mm -hmm. Look at you, good. That's about a half a teaspoon. I'm not good at measuring stuff. I'm trying to get better so I can do a book. <laughs> and then this is some almond extract that I bought from Miami at a Haitian place. Hmm. And it smells so good. And I've been using it anyway. I say that's about a half a teaspoon too. <laughs> so I add a teaspoon of flavor and if you I like almond a lemon extract would be good a rum extract with it with, with it would be good too I don't even like that let me try let me do it this way see if this bowl big enough 
You add a little bit, and then you get it. Okay, so now I'm going to grease the pan. I'm going to make a bunt cake. We're going to use a bunt pan, and I'm going to put this batter that looks really good and thick. I'm really going to spray this in here generous. I want you to see how thick this batter is. You see that? See how thick it is? Yeah, that's pound cake. Uh, pound cake thickness. Okay, so I put it in there and I smoothed it out. I put a lot of the baking spray in there and I'm gonna put this in the oven for 30 minutes. It really took about 40 minutes. As soon as the toothpick comes out clear, you're done. Okay, so, ooh, it looks so beautiful. All right, so I'm going to take it out. It fell right out. Oh my God, look how pretty it looks. Ooh. Oh, it looks so pretty. Now I'm a. Oh, it smells good too. Can't wait to get somebody to taste it. I didn't put the whip on this. Look at this. Look how pretty and moist this is. Mm. Okay, it's Whip It Wednesday. And on Wednesdays, I take something out of the box and I put the whip on it. So. I want you to be honest about how that tastes. That's a homemade, it's really a new flavor for me. It's kind of like a vanilla, just taste the taste. He got a sweet tooth too. Better in my mouth. Huh? It's better than my mouth. I know it's moist, ain't it? That tastes good. <laughs> so instead of water, I use buttermilk. Instead of oil, I use butter. And a little bit more butter and i put two different extracts in it but and so the whip was just saying you can take something out the box and make it taste homemade it tastes homemade don't it, it do <laughs> oh it's in a box yeah yeah yeah. it's a box cake this don't taste like no box cake right yeah, yeah, yeah. so it was supposed to be make it taste homemade so if you substitute some few things I had. We put the whip on it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, like, subscribe, and share. Let's make it happen.